fringe recommendations. What shows have you seen that people should see? Oh, I saw Shakespeare for breakfast. That was really good. Suze Kempner, Queen, is the best show on the fringe. Yeah, it was really, really funny as well. It was a really nice way to start the morning, actually. It just set me up for a really, really happy day. Queen, it's about how she is a massive Queen fan and it's stand-up about her life, but with Queen songs in it. Evil, George Street, um, La Sex, Lies and Taxidermy. Uh, well, I saw uh, We Are Ian yesterday, which is in Pleasant Stone, and that's yeah, really, really, really good. Richard Gad's show is really, really good. Um, it's a dance piece called Linger in Dance Space. It ends tomorrow, but it's really, really great. It's really interesting sort of experimental theatre. Uh, Nightmare's a load of fun. Um, <laughs> Nightmare's a load of fun. <laughs> it is a load of fun. Um, What's it about? Sorry, it's the old uh, 90s game show Nightmare. Uh, not, not a nightmare. I would recommend to see Dead Awaken in Venue 13. It's a really good show. It's uh, an adaptation of, of an Ibsen uh, play. And it turned into a comedy and opera. It's really good. Cool. I'm part of the Big Bite Size Breakfast. Uh, which is great, actually. It's really good fun. It's a bunch of award-winning short plays. Uh, Ten twenty every morning in the Queen Dome, and we'll give you croissants. How to win against history? Oh, okay. Is that the box just opposite the library? Yeah. Yeah. And it's super. It's um, high count, wonderful performance. And strawberries. Great music. And coffee. Oh my, it's not bad, eh? Tremendous charm. It's so good. We've seen some great stuff. When we saw Henry Rollins last night, it was fabulous and didn't even know he's on. That's why you watch our channel.